up everyone welcome back to my youtube channel if you have not yet be sure to subscribe you can also hit the notification bell down below so you guys can get notified every single time i upload a new video i mean guys for this video i am reviewing the all i want for christmas collection from b bella now this is a collection that launched last year and they brought it back for you guys to try out this year i guess it was that good and this is my first time trying it out so i wanted to review it for you guys not only that but of course i did a look i did use all the stuff in this little collection this is what the look is looking like so um i did go more on the wearable more natural side only because i already know that people are gonna go in with the reds the glitters it's all the way so which i did too honestly i made an instagram look using the red the bold color so if you guys want to go ahead and check that out on my instagram it's already up um but for this tutorial i wanted to do something wearable something that you guys can come back during Christmas and be like, you know what? I wanna do something subtle, something cute. So that's exactly what we're doing today. All right, you guys ready? Let's jump right into the video. Suavemente. Suavemente. There is just one thing I need and I. Imagine like I was a cantante and I actually know how to sing like, no, she's kidding. Hey, I'm not going to see my channel, girl. Anyway, let's jump into something that I do know I'm good at. Let's review some makeup. So we have here the Be Bella Cosmetics All I Want For Christmas Eyeshadow Palette and Lip Trio. So they launched this one actually last year. It was so adorable. I didn't get my hands on it last year, but guess what? I did for this year. So I got both little uh, sets right here. This is actually a whole collection. We're going to review it. We're gonna do a tutorial. We're gonna do a look. It's gonna be a thing. This is the All I Want for Christmas eyeshadow palette. Now I'm not gonna lie to you guys and say that this is the first time that I'm trying this out. It is not first impressions because I already tested the waters. I already tried it out. I played with it, but that does not mean I can't tell you my input girl for hold on, hold on. She does retail for $12 and the packaging is super cute. It looks like a little uh, present. It has a little bowl right here all throughout. Here's what she looks like. And when you want to open this up, you just slide the eyeshadow palette right out. And this is what the inside looks like. And yes, it is all glittery all throughout front and back. It is absolutely gorgeous. I am obsessed with this palette, with this look, with this packaging, just everything about it. But wait a minute, amigas, the best part is yet to come back. Let me open up this palette right before your eyes. Para que miren. Look at this gorgeous color story and tell me that does not scream holidays it has all the shades that you are looking for for this season so let me tell you guys my first impressions when i first received this palette and i opened it up <gasps> dude me quedé con los ojos pelados onto the eyeshadow palettes i could not take my eyes off of it so let me tell you the color story it screams holidays it tells you like i want to use this for christmas but what I'm loving about this palette that it's not only like red, white, black, you know, typical Christmas colors, but it does include a lot of neutral and transitional shades that makes it wearable for not only this season, but for continuous months. So it does have a white shade, a neutral tones right here for transitions. It has a deeper bronze shade right here. It has maroon tones, like a bunch of shimmers, four main glitters in the center, bunch of matte shades. It's just a good palette. Pero no solo eso, amigas it's $12 $12 and when it comes to Christmas makeup this is the type of palette that you're looking for something that's gonna have a little bit of everything and not only that but just looking at the packaging you know it gets you into the spirit you look at it you're like yep that's Christmas and I'm gonna start swatching these out for you but I'm gonna warn you these shadows girl they are so Freaking good. You know what? Mejor no les digo. Let me just show you. So the first shade that I'm going to swatch out, it is called Eggnog. And it is a matte white shade. And this is what she is looking like. I'm telling you, super pigmented. That's a matte white. To get it that white, guys, it is not easy. So I don't know how they did this for $12. But girl, they did not come to play. This next matte shade, it is called Cinnamon, and that's what she looks like. Super stunning. We have Rudolph. Ooh, I like this brown tone. This next shimmer, it is called Champagne Toast, and that is what she's looking like. She is serving, girl. Here we have Winter Candy Apple, which is a matte 
true red shade oh my god i used this one on my previous look and it is so stunning and pigmented y aquí se pone buena la cosa we're gonna get into the glitter shade this one is called frosty and just buckle your seat belt on girl like hold on to your chair i introduce to you frosty oh, oh that is a glitter it, the consistency of it, it is absolutely gorgeous. I did not need any kind of like anything to grip it down. It, oh my God, I, I can't even talk. Like I am so shook with this shade. It is so like foily, reflective. I know you're shook right now. I know you are just as shook as I was when I first seen this. This formula is on a whole nother level. I have no idea what they did to this shadow, but it feels like a shimmer, but it looks like a glitter. And it reflects so beautifully in the light. Oh, girl, it's just, it's just so bomb. And here are all the swatches for this palette, girl. This thing is thangin'. Look at all these beautiful shades that you can use for this season. Like, this palette has it all. Now, let's get on to a look. Let's play with them. Let's see what we can come up with. Let me quickly add a little bit of setting powder because I do have a finished face and I do not want any like red or colorful tones falling down on this. I'm also going to take my Moira concealer. I'm going to add this all over my lids to make it nice and tacky ready for eyeshadow. For this look I kind of want to do something on the wearable side since I did do a cut crease on my Instagram and something bold so I want to do something wearable I am going to begin with that eggnog shade which is that matte white one let's go ahead and place that in that inner corner part and I'm kind of flicking it back and forth and oh my god this formula is just so good I have not tried out this white eyeshadow and it's so pretty next I'm gonna take that cinnamon shade and I'm gonna follow up that eggnog shade and just place it right in the center of my eyes. And I'm just like going back and forth, blending it into that eggnog shade. And I am loving this tone, oh my God. She is gorgeous. I love this one. You can use it as a transitional shade or I definitely use this all over my lid. Like it is just nice. I'm gonna take the shade Chimney and I'm gonna pop that right in that outer corner. Oh my god, this shade is powerful. I did not think it was gonna be that pigmented. Let me go back in with another brush and just kind of blend it out. Oh my god, she is pigmented, but she is beautiful. Look how those two like blend in nicely. Look at that. No effort whatsoever. By the way, I am using this set of B Bella brushes. That is all I'm using for this look, and they are working phenomenal. These two shades just like, look at them. I'm like staring at my eye right here and it looks so pretty. Okay, let's try this again. I'm gonna use the same brush just for application and then go back in with the other bigger blending brush to blend that in. There we go. I just felt like this one was like trial and error and this one is tutorial. A Little bit more. Oh my god, amigas, I'm staring at this eyeshadow right now, and I am obsessed. Like, I love how these colors blended out so gorgeously. And look at this shape. It kind of, like, flatters my eyes. I'm loving it. I'm going to take a smaller brush, and I'm going to take the shade Champagne Toast. I'm going to place that in the inner corner. Just give me a little pop. Ooh, there we go. Just so it won't be an all matte look. Just a little hint of some, some girl. Look at that. Woo! And if you're brand new to my channel, this is the first video you ever watch of me and you really think that, damn girl, she really gets excited about makeup. Yeah, I really do. I'm just dusting off this setting powder because I want to do my under eye area. You know what? I low-key want to add a little bit of red just because it is a Christmas look and I want to put a little bit. You know what? Let's go ahead and grab some of that Winter Candy Apple, which is that red matte shade. And I'm placing it at an angle so you guys can see I'm kind of going like back and forth following that little smokiness of that brown shade and then going back in with a blending brush I'm gonna blend all those two all those three shades actually in together 
Ooh, there we go. Okay, I wanted to keep it nice and simple, but we got that little red on there. Okay, let me do the other side real quick. That looks good to me. Let me do some under eye action. Let me grab that chimney shade, which is that deep brown that we used to smoke out the outer corner. I'm gonna put that right in the bottom waterline. Okay, boys, there we go. I'm going to put on a little bit of mascara, pop on some lashes, and I'll be right back. And there we go, amigas. I popped on some very simple lashes because this is a simple look. So I went ahead and used my EXO Cosmetics lashes in the style. Really pretty. And I felt like they were like perfect for it. My eyes look nice. My lashes look simple. Let's get on to the second thing that we're going to review in this video, which is the All I Want for Christmas Lip Trio. It has the same type of packaging as the eyeshadow palette. When you open it up, Así se mira. It is a nice thick package. When you open it up, ira van a ver adentro. We get this gorgeous lip trio. This one does retail for $14. This is honestly such a stunning package for like a little lip trio. It is so gorgeous, eye-catching. It has the red lippy right here. It has a lip gloss and it does have a matte lipstick. And you guys can see it also has a mirror on top. So let's go ahead and bust out the red matte lipstick. Now I did use this on my previous Instagram look. This one is called Candy Cane Swirl, and it is a matte liquid lipstick. Y así se ve. And let's open this up. It has a nice little applicator like this. Let's swatch this on the back of my hand. It is very pigmented, bright red, and it has an amazing formula when I use this. I was actually very surprised at how neatly I was able to apply it. And here's the swatches of the three lippies in the lip trio. And I know I already used the lippy, pero pa que no digan que soy mala, I'm gonna try it out for you guys. So I'm gonna take the matte liquid red lippy and I am gonna apply it real quick para que miren como se mira. Did you see how easy that application was though? Like one little swipe and it covered my lips. Oh my God, I'm just staring at myself in the camera and I just cannot stop looking at my lips. They look beautiful. This is hands down the best red matte lippy that I own. Like I love the color. It is a true red. I love the finish of the formula and my lips look very nice and full. And it's surprising me that I didn't go in with a lip pencil. Like I always go in with the lip pencil and my lips look this good with it. Okay, let's go ahead and apply that one matte lipstick. Now this one for sure I am going to use a lip pencil. I'm going to go in with my Amuse Cosmetics lip pencil that it is included in my collaboration box. If you guys haven't watched the video, go ahead and check it out. But anyway, I'm going to use the pencil from that. Now let's go in with the matte lipstick and apply this to the center of my lips. <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> this is such a beautiful shade. Hold on, let me... Dude, I found a new favorite matte lippy. Look at this nude. It is so perfect. It literally suits me. It looks absolutely stunning i want to leave it alone but at the same time i want to add a little bit of that gloss because i want to use the whole lip trio so let's go ahead and do that let's add a little bit of that shimmery gloss and let's see what this thing do <gasps> oh girl yeah uh-huh this is it yeah, mic drop, literally, gloss drop. <sighs> Me encanta. Alrighty, amigas, and here we are. This is the final look. This is the look that I achieved using the All I Want for Christmas collection from Be Bella now. I am honestly head over heels over all the items that I just used. I love them. I highly, highly recommend them. If you are looking for the perfect Christmas collection for your makeup 
collection. <laughs> Go ahead and shop these. They are Alma approved. Not only that, but they're affordable, girl. Pero that is it. That is all I have for you guys today. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. If you did, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Let me know down in the comment section below which one was your favorite product. Do not forget to follow me on all my social medias. You guys could find me at Alma Rivera Beauty on Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok. Do not leave my channel before subscribing, girl. And I will see you guys on the next one. Bye!